well dear students now we will discuss about parkinson's disease parkinson disease also called parkinsonism disease or pd first of all let we know what is parkinson disease parkinson disease is a neurodegenerative disease mainly affects movement balance and muscle coordination neurodegenerative disease which means degeneration degeneration means loss or destruction and neuro means nerve neurons so here what happens some neurons will destroy destruction of neurons occurs neurodegeneration degenerative disease and those neurons which are responsible to produce neurotransmitter called dopamine which neurotransmitter called dopamine so parkinsonism disease is a neurodegenerative disease the loss or destruction of the neurons which are mainly responsible to produce the dopamine and affects movements affects our movements balance and coordination we maintain posture balance and coordination of our skeletal muscle so for example if we walk talk or whatever our voluntary activities voluntary activities means we want our own sense to contract uh, our skeletal muscle or we are talking while uh, our contracting our muscle facial muscle and different voluntary muscles which are called skeletal muscle skeletal muscle skeletal muscle so what happened in parkinson parkinson's disease they affects these things and they will lose the control and due to the losing of the control on voluntary muscles balance and coordination some sign and symptoms occurs parkinsonism disease mainly affects in the old people age above above 60 years and more common in men than women it is one type of aging disease old age disease because in during the old age nerves in the neurons also automatically loss or automatically destroy degeneration occurs anyway what are the sign and symptoms of parkinson's disease what are the sign and symptoms of parkinson parkinson's disease there are main signs and symptom of parkinsonism disease parkinson disease are called trep in short form abbreviation trep t means tremor t means tremor tremor meaning is the shaking the person while talking or walking the shaking of the arm shaking of arms legs jaws like this shaking continuously they will shake they cannot control that one voluntary muscles of hand arms our arms leg jaw all total our neck all this like a continuous shaking that is called tremor rigidity rigidity means stiffness rigidity means stiffness they cannot they will find it difficult to move the body difficult to move the neck like this rigidity they become more stiff next is a kinesia a means a kinesia a kinesia loss of movement people will difficult to walk difficult to run difficult to move this is called a kinesia p mean posture and balance posture and balance will become imbalance one cannot stand for particular position they cannot stand they cannot uh, sit in a particular posture or balance their loss of posture and balance will occur so these are the main sign and symptoms of parkinson's disease which are called t means tremor means shaking r means rigidity a means akinesia means loss of movement and p means imbalance posture and balance will occurs now etiology what is the cause of parkinsonism disease already we discuss parkinsons is a neuro degenerations loss of neurons will occurs and that neurons are mainly dopaminergic neurons 
dopaminergic neurons and they are mainly the cause of aging due to the old age automatically neurons loss will occur genetic cause environmental factor stroke and some antipsychotic drugs these are the most common cause of parkinson's disease aging genetics environmental factors pollutants or other stroke if someone suffer from the stroke in cerebral cortex region if damage of the neurons will occur and moreover antipsychotic drug some antipsychotic drug affects the parkinson disease affects cause the parkinson disease now how this occurs that is called pathogenesis how the loss of neurons will occurs in the brain cortex region one particular area is called name of that is called substantia nigra substantia nigra this is for example particular region is called substantia nigra here the neurons are responsible for production of dopamine they will product neurotransmitter neurotransmitter is called dopamine which maintain which maintain the movement balance and coordination of our skeletal muscle then what happen these neurons will damage loss of dopaminergic neurons will occur in substantia nigra and due to this loss of this neurons what happen dopamine level will decrease production of the dopamine level will decrease and due to this parkinsonism disease symptoms occurs parkinson's disease symptoms whatever we discuss these all trap tremor rigidity echinacea and posture imbalance these all symptoms will occurs now if we go in details how the loss of the neurons occur how the death of the neurons in physiological term apoptosis or, or it is called program cell death neuronal apoptosis occurs in substantia nigra how it will occur various factors like genetic factors or environmental factors they will cause the mutation they will cause the mutation in gene mutation in gen gene and produce alpha synuclein alpha synuclein lewis bodies and neuromelanin there are some particulars substances formed due to the mutation of gene in some particular person they are called alpha synuclein alpha synuclein lewis bodies neuromelanin and which cause the damage in the neurons like they will cause the protein aggregation they will cause protein aggregation some enzymes and proteins present in the neurons will aggregate they will join together mitochondrial dysfunction mitochondria of the neurons will dysfunction will damage and produces reactive oxygen species some free radical hydrogen peroxide sulfur uh, oxide like so many type of free radical will produce and they is due to this things what happen the cell will die which is called apoptosis similarly due to the environmental factors pollutants or others which can directly cause the damage to the neurons and due to that damage apoptosis will occurs apoptosis means the program cell death that is called program cell death slowly program cell death so apoptosis of the neurons will occur neuron will slowly die that's why sometimes parkinsonism parkinson's disease is called it is neurodegenerative progressive disorder progressive disorder means it occurs slowly and then finally result parkinson's disease this is about the pathogenesis of parkinson's disease now what are the complications occurs though movement complications occurs already we know that all the movement person will unable to move person will unable to walk freely persons will uh, feel difficult in eating uh, swallowing chewing talking 
and beside this bladder problems urinary uh, retention will occurs constipation will occurs sexual dysfunction occurs loss of sense of smell person will unable to get proper smell like this various types of complications occurs this about the brief about parkinson's disease